for this falafel wrap, you are obviously gonna need some falafel. I'm using the ones by this brand called Vega Vita. Um, then you're also gonna need some vegetables. You can choose whatever you want. You're gonna need some tortillas and also some hummus or any other spread you wanna put in there. You wanna cut up all your vegetables, put them on a big plate and then start heating up your falafel. I'm heating mine up using a pan, but you can probably use a microwave or the oven or something like that. Then I started um, spreading the hummus onto my tortilla and then adding the rocket salad first and then going along with every vegetable that I choose. So cucumbers, red peppers, tomatoes, um, some corn and some spring onion. Now I'm using three falafel on each wrap and I'm cutting them into halves so they fit better. Um, I'm also going to use some salt and some pepper to give it some flavor. And when I'm done with that, I'm really just wrapping this whole thing up. Um, I don't really have a good wrapping technique, but yeah, that's what I came up with and it was really good. You are gonna need boiled pasta and some vegetables. I'm using cucumbers, tomatoes, red peppers, and spring onions. I'm also gonna use some corn again, and then some rocket salad because, you know, why not? I had it lying around from the wraps, so I decided to use it. I'm also gonna roast some pine nuts because they are really delicious. And then just start mixing all this stuff together. So first I'm putting in the pasta, then all the vegetables, then I'm putting in the rocket salad, the corn, and the pine nuts. Now for my dressing, I'm adding some salt, some pepper, some extra virgin olive oil, some balsamic vinegar, and some balsamic cream because I really like the sweetness of it and like just balsamic vinegar would be too sour for me. Now you will need a ciabatta for this recipe, some olive tofu, some hummus and some vegetables of your choice. So I'm using cucumbers, tomatoes, red peppers and spring onions. Um, I sliced my tofu and I put it in a pan and I heated it up and like fried it or whatever until it was golden brown. Then I cut open my ciabatta and I spread some hummus on it like on either side. Then I put as much tofu as I could inside and afterwards stack the vegetables on top. Um, obviously you will probably not be able to put all the vegetables in but you know try to put as much in as you can because it tastes really really good if you have lots of different vegetables in. And I finished it off with some balsamic cream, you can also add some salt, some pepper or other herbs you want to put in and um, close the sandwich and you're pretty much done so that was really really yummy not gonna lie you will need some rice of course some carrots and peas i'm using frozen ones some sprouts i'm using mung bean sprouts some tofu spring onions peanut butter sesame oil and soy sauce so you want to Slice your tofu into little squares and put it on a baking sheet and pop it in the oven at 180 degrees Celsius for like 20-25 minutes depending on how long your rice takes to boil. Next you want to put some sesame oil into a pan and then add your carrots and your peas and when they are pretty much done add your sprouts and top it off with like a ton of soy sauce. Next I used a tablespoon of peanut butter and some soy sauce and like a teaspoon of sesame seeds and mix those together and then put the tofu in there because that's going to give our tofu a really really delicious glaze. So now it's time to bring all the ingredients together so I'm using my boiled rice, put it in the pan with the vegetables and mix it together. When that is done I just add my spring onions because I like them to be fresh and not cooked and then the tofu and can you just admire how amazing that looks it's so hard to do that voice over being hungry but yeah so you can just mix that together as well and you're pretty much done so 
that's how amazing that looks oh my god it's so delicious um but that's it with this video i really hope you liked it and i will see you in my next video bye